on boys welcome to another video so today we're doing something a little bit different why in the world hold on all right we're good so today we're doing something a little bit different and we're gonna be vlogging if you guys want to see some more vlogs on the channel you guys let me know I want to do more than just fishing videos you know I want to experiment with some other types of videos and make it really interesting for you guys so if you guys want to see some more blog blah, 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 son of a gun man vlogs <laughs> then comment below and pepper that like button up if you guys are new to the channel I'm Noah be sure to click that subscribe button also the notification bell well anyways the first thing I want to start off this video with is I was watching one rod one reels fishing video Last night at like 2 in the morning, I got like 30 seconds into the video, and then this popped up. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Did you guys see that? Like, what in the world was that? I swear it was a ghost or something. I was just watching it. I mean, it may be because I was like really tired. I got like an hour's worth of sleep, you know, the night before. But that was pretty freaky. I, I don't know what that was. If you guys know what that was, leave a comment below because to me it looked like a dang ghost went by. It was like all the way in the back alley. Something just swished by within like a couple seconds and it just boggled my mind. I like looked in the comments. Nobody commented about it. There was already like a thousand comments. I was like... How in the world is no one else freaking out about this? It kind of freaked me out, man. It kind of spooked me. Yeah, so anyways, that was the first thing I wanted to say today. Um, let's uh, let's get outside. Before we go outside, I would like to say I just dropped the online store brand new clothing line. We got the American flag fishing t-shirts. We got the American flag fishing sweatshirts. We got the old drip sweatshirts, the drip t-shirts, the drip corner tees, the drip corner sweatshirts we got everything guys and it is fire is the new brand new clothing line we're gonna have new designs dropping every single month so stay tuned for that if you could at least go over to you know the website and at least give me some feedback on what you guys think about the new site i worked my booty off on this one so if you could at least go check it out and you know cop yourself some tees and sweatshirts if you'd like and uh if you guys do you guys send me pictures of you guys wearing the sweatshirts or t-shirts whatever it is i will post it up on my kicking the rest tv instagram story and all also my team KTV TV page on Instagram as well so be sure to go follow those if you haven't already but anyways we're gonna get today chopping and I'm gonna explain what's going on so we got the old Under Armour boots today I can get these dirty I can run them in the woods I really don't care I can get them in the water but uh yeah I haven't even wore these before it's the first time freaking breaking them in man these are really uh stiff but let me show you one more thing you guys see this right here this is actually something that i vlogged going to pick it up and this is a brand new kayak trailer guys this is brand new for the old yaks me alan bob adam and whoever else wants to come we can slide our kayaks right on this and tow it behind this bad boy and there isn't an addition that I'm gonna add on to it. I'm gonna actually add, you know, another post right here and it's gonna have two more mounts that I can load kayaks on. So there's actually gonna be four of these. So I can load up four kayaks. This is actually a really light trailer here. Let me show you guys. I mean, it's pretty light. I mean, you can pick it up super easy, super light trailer. I'm gonna be towing that behind this bad boy, obviously. And I actually just got this ceramic coated. So it's all, oh my gosh, that's amazing. My sponsor hooked me up big time, John with All South, teamallsouth.com. Go peep it if you haven't. And uh, gosh, man, my buddy Chris washed it up really good, put the coating on, and it's looking amazing. So we were actually about to head into the woods behind my house. And I can tell you one thing, I have not been there in years. All right, I mean years. When I was younger, when I was a little boy, I used to walk out in the woods. We used to play little airsoft wars and we just go chop stuff down and go walk back there and there's a reason why i'm going into the woods so let's go ahead and get back there i'm gonna explain that and uh like i said it's been about eight years first peak oh my god holy crap what in the world man i'm kind of upset what is going on back here well a huge freaking tree fell and it is literally a freaking forest. When I was younger, this right here, oh my gosh, look at this, guys. This is the old rope swing I had. I cannot tell you how old this is. Look, we got it way up there. Oh my gosh. I mean, I, guys, this is probably from when I was like 10 years old, like a solid 11 years ago. This is insane. And I actually chopped all this down. This used to be like everything right here used to be like that. 
and I used to come out here for fun and make trails back in this woods back here and look at all this now I mean there's a huge tree that fell over this one snapped in half I don't know what happened with all this I did not know this happened I mean I haven't been back here in 10 years but this is kind of crazy and look at this like a forest See, this is all the stuff I used to chop down but this is this is kind of crazy oh my god about fell this is not good this is going to be a lot harder than I expected for what I'm doing today which I haven't even told you guys oh man oh boy this is like a little fort down here man i would have loved this when i was younger this how the heck is there a rock down there and i have no idea how this huge tree fell had to have been definitely when the hurricane came i, I don't know there's been a hurricane the past couple of years that's had to have been when it fell for sure i used to have a trail that went back here too just all loaded back up i guess that's what happens 10 years later you know uh things kind of grow up but this is way more grown up than i thought it was going to be Got us an old uh, basketball. Yeah, who who knows how old is that? A football or basketball? Definitely a basketball. A small basketball, unless it shrunk up. Five hour energy. Golly, man. This is upsetting. So the main reason why I was gonna make this video is because there's actually a huge creek behind my house in these woods. It's literally about 100 foot this way. And I had trails that used to lead to it, but obviously it's really grown up now. I mean like really grown up. So that's something we're gonna have to figure out. I wanted to walk down here just to see how could we get to the creek. Because one, if we get to the creek, we can do two things. One thing, catch some old crawfish, some old crawdads, which is something I've been wanting to do for a while. Then we can take the crawdads, and then we can go fishing with live bait. We can do a live bait video with that. If you guys wanna see that, let me know because that's what I plan on doing. And two, we can do some creek fishing. And three, we could do some micro fishing. And four, we could uh, try to catch, you know, whatever's in the creek. I mean, we can do a bunch of videos of that. So. I'm really wanting to figure out how to get back here. Here's one of the trails. Should I just walk this? Should I just say screw it? My problem is it's like all briars. It's been raining so much, like made another pond. And I'm pretty sure I hear the creek. Well, there's all the water. There's a ton of water. There's briars everywhere. A ton of water right here. Another tree that fell. This is actually a long path that leads to the big mouth of this creek. The creek goes right back here all the way down and then it actually reaches a point when it gets over here kind of by my house and it opens up into a big circle which is the deepest part of the creek and that's where a lot of fish are loaded. I don't know if you guys can hear in the background noise, you probably can't, but the creek is actually flowing way back there. This thing goes for a while. It goes throughout my whole neighborhood. I can make this really easy and go in one of my neighbor's backyards, but we don't want to make it easy here. We want to work our way back to this creek and see if we can do it ourselves from my house. Well, coming back to over here, we're going to have to figure out a way to get through this. But first, I'm going to try to go through. I have a little gate that connects back here. Maybe if I go through there, it won't be as bad and we can reach back to that creek. I think we're going to be in for a surprise on this one. Oh my god. Well nice. Fence is freaking broke too. And uh, I guess people that are doing our yard decided just to dump every leaf in the universe back here. And I remember that soccer ball. I don't know if you guys see that back there, soccer ball. But look at this. Well, boys, there's only one way to figure this out. And it is just to go back here. I'm about sinking deep right there. I don't know what I'm walking on right now. Oh my gosh, but I do not like it. Ugh, I'm falling. Woo. I don't know if they put a tarp under that or something, but something's crunched. Oh my gosh. Oh God, I'm knocking myself out. This right here just freaked me out. So this is the end of my fence. My neighbor got a fence not too long ago. And I guess he has a gate. That probably wouldn't have been easy just to ask him instead of crawling through this forest right here. But I think we're in the clear. This is really good. This is better than what I was thinking. This leads back. And then you take a right. So right here seems good. But the fact of the matter is when we get back over here. Oh, man, you can see the creek. Oh, yes, people, you're about to see this. See, that's the problem. But if I can get some boots where we can walk in the creek, we should probably be able to get to it. Yeah, this used to be a whole lane I chopped down. Not anymore, oh baby. Oh man, I like this. I like this a lot. Here's the creek. Let's see if we see any fishies swimming. Nah, I don't see any fish swimming, but we got access to the creek. That's the biggest thing. Cause if I can get some waders and walk in there, then I can at least walk down. I can actually hear where the water is way, way back there to where the water's running that we can get to. The problem is like I could easily walk through this maybe 
Yeah, probably not. But if I have fishing poles, there is no way I'm walking through this with fishing tackle and fishing poles. I definitely have to hop in the water and walk down. That would probably be my best bet. So I just said screw it, and I walked right through all this stuff. There's a bunch of briars and everything. It's a little open area right here that walks. And pretty much on the other side of this is the freaking creek. So I think we're good to actually come back here and fish. I think this is a pretty open area. I mean, look, I can walk now. This is perfectly fine. Oh, oh, I see it. Oh, it does it look juicy. Oh, you guys are about to be amazed by this. I used to fish back here. This is kind of like where I started fishing. I was creek fishing for brim some i actually caught one baby bass back here before and a lot of sucker fish well 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 i think we made it people and wait till i turn this around this is gonna be sweet right here i know you guys hear it i know you guys hear the water you don't see it yet but you hear it oh this is awesome this brings back major memories look at this so we were way 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 down there it rolls all the way down i fished here a lot caught a lot of fish comes down runs right across here there's a bunch of rocks. We used to ride four wheelers right over this and back into there. I don't know if you guys can tell. We used to drive our four wheelers right over this. A bunch of rocks and a bunch of major current flowing down into this creek. And like this is the little opening that's really deep back in there. And then it loops back around and that's my neighbor's house right there. That's my house, that's my neighbor's. And then it just loops back around. So there's a lot of fish in here. And this is where we will majorly be catching them is all up in here since the water's so deep compared to you know inches of water pretty much throughout there it's a little bit deeper right here and i've caught a lot of fish there but it's super shallow and then it drops off i should probably roll the camera right here just in case i bust my butt while i'm doing it might as well right oh yeah the perfect little creek behind my house in atlanta in my neighborhood how cold this water is right here I know it's gonna be cold Wow yeah this water is <coughs> freaking ice cold man this is gonna be awesome the perfect area to film some fishing videos and more creek fishing videos like this I've actually never filmed a creek fishing video on my channel and that's why I want to do this I want to experiment with new things it's gonna be so fun and if you guys really want to see some creek fishing videos, let me know in the comment section below or if you have any suggestions what I should do here. And also, pep that thumbs up button, baby. All right, I'm leaving here. I just really wanted to show you guys this. Brings back a lot of good memories from my childhood and fishing back here in creeks and catching, you know, little micro fish that live in these little creek systems. And just with it being right behind the house, that makes it even better. Even though I'm not here, you know, most of the time of the year, I'm only here about four to five months a year but that is just awesome we're gonna have a lot of fun with this place well where are you fishing well uh my grandparents actually live in i don't even know the name of the say hi to the camera howdy folks fisher with norm coming at you go subscribe to this man's channel i just made it to the old backyard of the house well give me some suggestions what you want me to do back in that creek i got like a week here until i go back to savannah so i would like to film some content down there i don't really know what i want to film so you guys should definitely leave some suggestions in the comment section i do want to go catch some crawl dads i want to go to walmart get some traps do that whole deal set them out and then go fishing with the bait obviously but i want to do some more things and then we could just do basic fishing down there um some basic creek fishing that would always be really fun but i know you guys come up with creative ideas so if you guys have something that you would like want to see you guys are like man this would be dope down there then let me know i think i'm gonna sign off this video but if you guys could please go check out the clothing store or it's not even the clothing store it's my new website it's just kicking their bass it's not kicking their bass tv.com it's just kicking their bass.com i'll leave a link below you guys can go check it out it would be amazing if you guys could support me and either pick up you know some standard tees or premium tees or sweatshirts i got beanies i even got a backpack i got a bunch of different stuff i got the american flags everything on there and it's pretty sick leave some your comments below on what you guys think of the website because i worked my tail end off on it and i think it looks really great but i would like to know you guys' feedback thank you guys so much for the support if you guys haven't already be sure to click that subscribe button if you guys think i should do some more 
more vlogs, pepper that like button up and leave a comment below. Let me know. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Keep it up, keep it up. They gon' try you, they can't stop you. Eat it up, eat it up. Pac-Man, Pac-Man.